When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny. extensions, jump squats, we might go into 40, we might go into some front squats, I mean, um, yeah, some front squats and some uh, lunges as well, so about five exercises, um, once again, high reps. Also, San Diego Comic Con, I leave tomorrow to San Diego, so if you will, will be around, make sure you hit me up. Finish out with the four plate burnout. Be rough as possible. Three sets, thirty reps. As many reps as possible, lunges for supersets. A1, A2. Like this, it's all about keeping the intensity. You know, just keep it going, keep it going, just try to keep it moving. Don't take too small of a rest time, I mean, too large of a rest time. Somebody's trying to come talk to you, tell them to go away, get in here, and then just fucking get after it right now.
teardrop. One thing that I, I know how to develop, one reason I know how to develop teardrop is because I've had a great teardrop before, and that's right here, it's inside area, right? That nice, nice bulge right there. What you wanna do is you wanna grab plates like this, and your foot placement is gonna be out. Put those toes out, and what we wanna do, we're gonna come right here. Big toe, and you'll feel it more. necessary for the long haul. A lot of people ask, yo, what's wrong? Why do you go up, you know, and wait, and then you stop and then build yourself back up? Because, fuck, I hit a certain weight, like I'm good. I hit 630, I'll squat, 640, whatever. I'm good, and I'm chilling out. Because it took a lot of effort and, and damage to get there. And I can't constantly keep doing that, man. Okay, I can't constantly keep lifting heavy all the time, bro. I don't, you know, people think my recovery is insane. Like, yeah, I got good recovery, I guess, whatever. I don't really get sore and all that shit, but my joint, that shit hurts, bro. Bench your 500 year round? Fuck no, nah, bro, that shit hurts. You know what I'm saying? Even bench your 450 sometimes, that shit hurts. And, you know, I can't keep that up all year round. That's why I take breaks and work back up to it. You know, I think that, that speaks to it itself, you know? Sometimes I go past that weight, you know, and but sometimes I don't. I just get back to that weight, uh, that, that main level. You know, it's just the progress of constantly, you know, constantly getting back. Um, it, it just what keeps me in the gym, man. It's just what keeps me in the gym, you know. I like to work out, I just love to train. I don't have any specific goals. Uh, I like the comment that said, you know, to like Teron, yo, you're not, you're not fat, but you're not cut. You know, you found like a like a happy balance. And you know, that's what I believe I have. I found a happy balance for myself to where I'm not super shredded, but I'm not fat either. Some angles on camera, I can be fat or whatever. I can be watery on some days, you know, but heck, I'm, I'm, I, I, I live free. I live and enjoy, you know? No hard dieting, everything is simple. I eat whatever, you know? And if I feel like I'm getting out of hand, I go into control mode. I do my cardio, do my training, and just fucking enjoy, bro. A lot of y'all worry too much about just so much other bullshit that don't mean nothing, man. Just fucking enjoy lifting, man. That's all I gotta say. But on that note, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. I'm out. 
see my people at San Diego Comic Con. And uh, much love. We took a nap. When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny. My name is Jeff.